Budget Windows machines have become pretty easy to find, but should you actually buy them? Asus' latest 2-in-1 provides some good reasons to be cautious. Now, at a glance, the TP200SA Flip looks nice. It has a handsome exterior with a brushed aluminum look, and while most of the system is plastic, the materials feel fairly sturdy in hand. The keyboard makes full use of the notebook's modest size, the touchpad is large, and the 720p display has a decent maximum contrast of 770 to 1. The system is also a 2-in-1, so the display can be folded back to convert it into a tablet. Like most of its peers, the Flip is a bit too bulky for comfortable long-term use in tablet mode, but it'll do in a pinch. And the system has a surprise on its flank, a USB Type-C port. That's a rare find in a budget PC. But none of this really matters because the system's Intel Celeron N3050 dual core is far too slow. It produced the lowest Geekbench scores we've seen in 2015. Even simple tasks like web browsing execute in starts and stops as the chip tries to keep up. Want to edit a video or play a game? Forget about it. You'll go office space on the flip in minutes. This notebook's performance woes aren't unusual. We've received a number of slow budget systems this year, all powered by Intel Atom or Celeron chips. This Asus, priced at 350, proves you have to be careful how you tighten your belt.